Pisces. This life try to turn me to a savage. And the devil trying to tell us that we average. Try to put us in the casket. We wear diamond 24 carats. Hey, hey. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Look now. Look now. Look. <laughs> We've been having some crazy energy coming out, Pisces. All these low vibrational energy trying to test us and stuff. We got to shake them off. Get them off our back real talk. You understand me? Listen. 24 Carat, all right? That's the name of the song by John Keith, Indie Tribe, and Mowgli the Iceberg, right? If y'all interested in, you know what I'm saying, looking the song up. Let's do a new love reading, Pisces. Oh, like magic. I got Jesus. I ain't trying to, uh, uh, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Shit, he be ripping on this stuff. Anyway, listen. And the devil trying to tell me that I'm average. I ain't even went through the formalities, y'all. I'm so over the, the, the low vibe and energies. You know what I'm saying? So let's do a new love reading. Because I know all of us ain't out here going through no crazy shit with karmic ass motherfuckers. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, hey, y'all. <laughs> if you're new here, hi, I'm blue. <laughs> and yes, I'm lit. But for good reason, because we got good shit coming to us. You know what I'm saying? Yes, new, new, new love, new romance. You understand me? We come against all that low vibrational energy that the enemy is trying to send our way. You understand what I'm saying? Forget that. We bought that shit up and we throw it back. Okay? We reject that shit. No, no, no. We done work too hard on our healing, on our progress, okay? On our clarity of mind, on our intuition. You understand what I'm saying? We ain't got time for these low vibrational people to come back and try to pull us back down to where we didn't fought so hard to not be <laughs> like to not be there so i want to do i really want to do a past present future that's what spirit is leading me to do okay i'm praying that it's going to show us some good shit you understand what i'm saying spirit help me tap into the pisces collective give us some good news Okay, show us the good shit that's about to come to us because we tired of these people pulling on our energy. You understand what I'm saying? So show me some good stuff, Spirit. What's what's going on? What's real talk? All right, he said, they say pull up. Okay. All right. Look, God is in the building. Okay. <laughs> the Hierophant, that's God. That's my God card. Let's see what's going on. All right, we got the, uh, what is this? Fairy fairy tarot cards I got my fairy boo up there looking at me hey boo <laughs> yeah so let's see what's going on um but no if you're new here thank you so much for visiting planet pisces this is a place created just for us to come and be whoever the hell we want to be or whatever that we want to be whoever that is that we want to be okay so welcome 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 if you feel uh comfortable you know what i'm saying you like our vibe you understand what i'm saying you like this tribe <laughs> then um go down below visit that subscribe button click it real quick and you'll be a citizen of planet Pisces. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And to all the returning citizens, hey, y'all. I love y'all. Y'all know what to do. Comment section. Chop it up with your girl. You know how we get down, right? And don't forget to like the video, everybody. It's a dope-ass way to exchange some positive energies. And it helps your tarot readers to tap into your situation your energy and whatever is going on around you okay so let me calm the help down i got lit okay so the number 24 could be significant for some of you guys 42 could be significant some of y'all could be this age something significant could have happened to you around this age let me tell you you got the six of wands six of spring out here that came out i ain't even asked for nothing yet spirit but okay six of springs acknowledgement elevation you understand what i'm saying getting your roses while you here all right a lot of you guys could be feeling like you are underappreciated or unappreciated like you have done things in your life or you have accomplished things in your life and people may not have even recognized you all right the six of spring say wonderful news is on thank you can we just Thank you, angel team, spirit team. Thank you because Noah, Noah with all that other shit. All right, they like, stop talking about the thing. <laughs> anyway, it says wonderful news is on its way. Smart choices that bring rewards. 
success in public recognition all right some of y'all could definitely be in the public eye all right okay some about victorian somebody okay victor okay some about victorian victoria victor okay he said enemy oh shit we ain't got time now you see it's a question mark behind it he said enemies got a lot of enemies what you talking about it's no big deal Do or die. He said, love your fellow man and give him more life. You understand me? Damn right. Life experience. So some of y'all, yeah. With the eight of autumn, that's the eight of pentacles. Going Simba aligned with his pride. A Leo could be significant. It says, let go of belief systems that no longer work for you, Pisces. It's an important, this is an important life-changing event going on right now. This is a situation that will lead to significant opportunities, okay? Release those things. Let those things that no longer serve you fall away. You understand what I'm saying? Y'all are working on something, though. The eight of, what is this called? Eight of autumn is the eight of pentacles. You understand what I'm saying? The man got his head down in the tarot card. And he banging on something. He working on some shit. And he putting his trophies up. Something you about to be recognized for something. You understand me? Real talk. With this saying, success and public recognition, the dude in the tarot deck, he's literally, he has like pinnacles posted up on a tree. Those are awards. Don't, he's, he's, uh, he's happy. He is um, proud. That's the word I'm looking for. He is proud of his achievements. It's, it's step into your shit, Pisces. Step into your, 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 your strength, your pride. Okay, something about a following. Okay, because I'm thinking of a pride. That's a lion, and it's pride. You understand what I'm saying? I don't know where you came from. Okay, it says do more research before proceeding. Education in the form of seminars, going back to school, or apprentice apprenticeships. Excellent craftsmanships in long term projects. Okay. So some of you guys could be working on a new, <clears throat> okay, some of y'all could be starting your own business or have some form of business. I'm seeing very much online. Spiracy keeps saying online, okay? All right, some of y'all might need a massage or something. It says bring fun into everything you do. Juggling multiple priorities or jobs. An exceptional talent for multitasking. All right, that's the two of pentacles, all right? And life experience just came out again. Some of you guys are transitioning from one phase of your life to another. Y'all might be leaving jobs, leaving relationships, leaving homes, okay? Leaving leaving family, friend, whoever, all right? Mm -hmm. So show me what's going on with Pisces right now, spirit. Our card, high priestess. Okay, it says trust your intuition, careful reflection before taking action, insight that comes through meditation. All right, I feel like some of y'all are really, really, really like y'all are changing up some shit. Real talk, stuff is changing, Pisces, but it's it, but it's a very big message here about just make sure you're taking your time okay before you make any kind of big decisions make sure you have shit in line like things are in line okay i'm seeing the eight of pentacles again how he, he had those pentacles lined up okay he didn't start working on you know what i'm saying like he worked on those and then he finished it and put it up then he started working on that other thing right he started working on that eighth pinnacle really if i'm not mistaken it was a pinnacle on the ground too so it might be something that's not that you might be missing like one thing that might be like right down there on the ground that you haven't started working on yet this might be the new thing that's coming into your life right mm -hmm. mm. all right aquarius libra gemini could be significant with the king of winter here also another pisces all right 
King of Winter, knowledgeable, experienced, fair-minded, unemotional. Okay. It says, get advice from someone professional and objective, public speaking. Okay. Some of you guys, like I said, I feel like some of you all might have platforms or might be influencers or something of that nature. All right. This could also be a sign of an unemotional relationship. We ain't got time for that shit though, right? We ain't doing all of that. Nope. <clears throat> God damn it, boy. Princess of Summer. Gentle, sensitive, kind, inexperienced. All right, definitely something new going on here. It says a new relationship or emotional experience. Invitation to social events. A compassionate friend you can share your concerns with. So what's coming towards Pisces here in the near future spirit? Please tell me some good news. This is some good shit coming out tonight. Healing. I'm with the B. That's just some music that is healing. Eh. Sit back and catch a feeling. Oh. Give it to me now. Okay. Hey. He said, hop inside because I'm going to take you there. Let's go. Y'all ready? I know how to gas the ship up. Y'all ready? I'm telling you. But that's Joey Vantes healing, okay? Y'all, so, uh, King of Winter came out again. Spirit. Whew. All right. Uh, Aries could be significant as well with the dreamer. That's like the full card. It says, embrace your true purpose, Pisces. Don't let nobody fuck with you in that too. All right? Real talk. Some of y'all have a calling on y'all. I fuck that. All of us have a calling on our lives, right? But I feel like a lot of you guys are coming up to a spot where you are actually, like, you are walking in your purpose. All right, a lot of y'all could have had obstacles or something, like, trying to block you from your ultimate purpose, your higher purpose. My peace of mind. That's just some music that is healing. The type you close your eyes, sit back and catch a feeling. Let me stop. <laughs> I'm lit. All right. So the Empress came out, but the Eight of Winter came out as well. Okay. Listen, Pisces, with the Empress and the High Priestess, this is divine feminine energy. You understand what I'm saying? I don't care if you're a man or a woman. You understand what I'm saying? This is very much divine energy here. Okay. But the Eight of Winters, the Eight of Swords, okay, that's self imprisonment, that is doubt. That's fearful. That's being trapped in your own head. You understand what I'm saying? That's that's a a a, a what's the I can never think of the freaking word. Oh my god, I can't think of the word. But whatever this is, it's like doubt. Don't doubt yourself, Pisces. You are the Empress. You are the Emperor. You understand what I'm saying? Some of y'all could be loners. The Star Ringo loner. Okay, I know you've been through shit, but I've been through both, so I ain't surprised. You understand me? It says for the Empress, it says it's time to take action. The power of creativity. You know, we're very creative, Pisces. Success that allows for a life of luxury. Pisces, do not doubt yourself. If spirit has been tugging on your heart to start some creative process, whether that is art, music, drawing. I guess art and drawing is the same thing. But y'all get what I'm saying. Some of y'all can have fire in your chart. And if y'all are wondering about your birth chart, I have a link in the description box at the bottom of the description box. It's a link to get a free birth chart. I have no affiliation with uh, it. It's Cafe Astrology if you don't want to click my link. All right. Um, you can look on there and just, just know your date and time of birth and where you were born. Okay. Like the city and state. Anyway, for the eight of winter, it says you have what it takes. If only you believe in yourself, Pisces. Thinking that you're powerless when you're not. A lack of self-confidence that keeps you from getting what you want. All right. I don't think I talked about it in this video. But it is the new moon in Virgo today. I don't know if I'm going to post this tonight or tomorrow because it's kind of late. But um, regardless, the energy of the new moon is still going to be potent the day after too. All right. Set your intentions. All right. 
I was going to say, okay, propel your prayers, okay? So some of you guys could be working with other things to um, in intensify your intentions, okay? Things like herbs, like magic, real talk. Um, scripting, which is writing your intentions out, right? Affirmations. Thank you, spirit. Get y'all some affirmations. You don't have to go buy a deck. You can write the holes out on cards. I was showing in a personal reading earlier that I am financially, what does I say? I am financially intelligent. Money flows to me easily and effortlessly. These types of things not only increase your vibration, but it attracts whatever it is that you desire. All right. But before we try to work on you know what I'm saying? Getting stuff with other people. Work on getting stuff with yourself straight first. You know what I'm saying? Did I say that right? <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, y'all. I hope y'all get what I'm trying to say. Like, we got to definitely focus in on us. Are we straight before we try to attract, like, love, for instance? You know what I'm saying? Are we good? You know what I'm saying? Because you attract what you put out. Right? Every Every situation we find ourselves in, we attracted that shit. I don't care what it is. I know that might be a hard pill to swallow sometimes, but it's the truth. Real talk. All right. All right, what's this? The Prince of Springs. That's the Prince of Wands. All right, immediate action. A challenge you can successfully manage, Pisces. A passionate relationship for some of you guys. God damn it, boy. Definitely for some of y'all, the emperor to match your empress. Get your shit straight, Pisces. Raise your vibration. Keep raising your vibration. You've been raising your vibration. You've been praying. You've been patient. Raising your vibration. Damn right. You're attracting your emperor. And if you're an emperor, you've been attracting your empress. All right? Continue to heal, babe. I love y'all. I'm going to um, close this message out. Do not forget to like the video for your girl. Prince of Winter, set out an intellectual solution to your problem. The need to act quickly and decisively. Sudden and unexpected changes. Look at the cute little bear. He's so cute. Something about speaking. Something about riding an animal. I don't know. What are we talking about? A horse? I don't know. A bull? Shit, I don't know. It's Shibuya Call by Andy Minio. Shibuya Roll Call. All right. Andy Minio and words play. Shibuya. I don't know what that means. It's some form of change coming. On the bottom of the deck is the Eight of Springs. That's the Eight of Wands. That's the Eight of Wands. That's happening fast. That's fast motion. Stress that comes from having many things happening at once but successfully multitasking sudden events or changes oh my god definitely something is about to pop off pisces all right you got the tower sitting here oh shit some of y'all might be getting a, a offer okay with the ring here and then the stork some of y'all could be expecting all right Whatever is going on, though, is bringing stability into your life. Oh, my God, with the tree. And then the ship is right up under that. Oh, my gosh, y'all. These are nothing but good cards. Thank you, spirit. Hi, hey, yeah. We needed it. <laughs> I'm telling you. Wow. Your ships are coming in, Pisces. Believe that shit. Write that shit down. My ship is coming in. My ships are coming in. Put that somewhere in front of you where you can see it every day. You understand what I'm saying? To remind yourself. I am successful. I am abundant. Money flows to me easily and effortlessly. Love flows to me easily and effortlessly. I am successfully attracting my soulmate. I am successfully attracting my twin flame. Whatever your desires, write that shit down. This is a very, very powerful time to do it with this new moon and Virgo energy. All right? And it's you can multitask successfully. All right? Virgo is like very much the task taker what you call it like note keeper like bam 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 you know what i'm saying very much organized and all of that shit is what i'm feeling keep oh keep climbing i see the other side deck of the mountain hey keep climbing all right 
is other side by Holby, okay? I love y'all so much. Keep your head up. Because we got this shit. We growing. We 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 healing. I I'm telling you. I love y'all so very, very much. Hit your girl up in the comment section down below. Like the video. Thank you to everyone who is donating to the channel, who's getting personal readings. Y'all bless my spirit. And I pray that everything that y'all do for me, God, return that to you three times, 333. Love y'all. <laughs>